I didn't really vlog yesterday, but nothing crazy happened. We just went shopping, and then at the end of the day, we entered this place called Crowd House. Day two, and we'll just see where the day takes us. That's what's happening. So let me do a little OOTD for you guys. My top is from Urban Outfitters. My shorts. Are from Zara and my glasses are really bad. Top on outfit has trousers, Zara, shoes, naked wolf. Period. lashes on just in case you're wondering what's different about this day with the lashes anyways subscribe and don't leave a like shut record up. video as fast as you can shut up. anyways we are uh, just like we did yesterday we're shopping i feel like our favorite activity to do in this household is actually just to shop so that's all we've been doing in the past few days but like um that would change soon <laughs> i just went into oh, my lips are dry I'll just give you guys a quick update but my eyes actually look so empty because all my individual lashes are gone but i'm getting them done soon i'm getting them done on friday so if now i'm seeing if now soon i will book like a lash appointment hey if now and already book like a lash appointment for friday so i'm very excited i hope it's a good shot But like, I don't know, there are, we're going to Macy's again to help my mom pick an evening gown for this event that she has. No, I'm just going out to try and find something for her to wear. Just give me some time. I know you're scared to settle down. A broken past has let you down. Take your time and ch I've been having these really weird dreams. In an instant, I'm fully immersed, and in the other, I cease to exist. She's like, not how she wanted it, but I think it looks nice. Do you get it? Yeah. Look at me. Ah, I'm a little shower, Demma. You're moving. Let me see. Your lashes are nice. Your lashes are nice. Who did you always say? I don't know her name. But what's going on? Please give my jacket. <laughs> <laughs> did you say close your eyes? Close your eyes. Thank you. Hey, you are, I actually you are nice. Yeah, so I nice. for that I actually give them like an Wait, eight point. Wait, give you a blank. Them like an eight Hello? point eight point five because the hygiene. Um, because some of them are actually Hello? really yeah. good and their lashes are actually nice. Yeah. The only thing I would say that naturally their lashes you are like thin. So like you're someone who likes like full set of lashes, like volume and like for it to be long and all of that. Then they're probably not the place for you. But like apart from that, to be honest, they're actually really good. I'm not gonna say that. But like yeah, Anaka is not very impressed with her lashes because she usually gets like really full 
volume lashes and then if now if now that is actually really nice yeah so my lashes are quite if good she does, if she does not like if she does not like it then i don't even understand which one is doing her that is actually really nice yeah her lashes are my nice. own they're okay i wish they were fuller but my own they're fine like, i don't I, mind i think you is even fuller than my own <laughs> trust me i know they're not because i got like 15 yeah, no, my own's a 15 like inch i'm not going to 18 17 Mo huh? 18. my own's 15 sha Anyways, you guys, back. Let's backtrack a bit. We anyway, picked Ifnaya from the train station, and then we headed straight to the last place. I didn't show you guys Ifnaya. That's Ifnaya behind us. So we are going to head back to the hotel and get dressed, and then I'll see you guys later. I know you've been waiting for me on this channel. Well, I'm finally here. Okay. So, hi. Nice. This is going to, get to be the intro. Today you're going to pull out to explore <laughs> New, New York, York City. Anyways, anyways, nice child. Today um, we picked Ifna from the trans, I said trans, train station this morning. It picks me after ten years. I, I, I picked them because I have to get walk by them. <laughs> And then we're going to this place called the Met. We're waiting for Naka, we're waiting for Chinema to get come down. You guys, I haven't seen if now seven years. Seven years later, and I don't feel like. Yeah, I don't they saw like, me and they walk like it's over here today. I'm like. Spanish and she doesn't want to sound jack. Remove, remove. She said, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Because I'm learning. What the hell? You're learning. You're learning. You're learning. So we are currently walking. Where did you get? <laughs> I swear. But we're currently walk, walking to the Met Museum. It's 11 minutes away. I'm so far we've walked um, six minutes. We'll be there soon. <laughs> Ale 
Houston um, and I haven't picked up my camera in a while I wanted to give you guys like a mini Sephora haul so that's what I'm gonna do mm. I picked all of these up in New York and can I just say that every single time I and my sisters go to Sephora it's always a full-blown disaster because you always end up picking up both the things you actually need and things that you don't need i feel like that's the same thing for like everybody but anyways i'm proud to actually say that this time i actually picked out things that i know i actually picked out things that i know that i actually use so i didn't just go and do anyhow i put them inside my suitcase so everything's a bit like compressed so i think the first thing I will be showing you guys I'm trying to make it more presentable because everything just got squashed in my suitcase. The first thing is this Inky List Old, Old Clinton Balm. I don't use makeup wipes to take off my makeup. I only use like micellar water and a cotton pad to probably take out my eye makeup. And like, yeah, that's all. But like, I stopped using makeup wipes. So, like, the only cleansing balm that I've actually been using for like a while is the chamomile cleansing balm from the body shop but like when i went to sephora one of the salesperson recommended this the salesperson in sephora oh gosh people yeah, these lashes they're just so fluffy like what the hell the sales babe recommended it and i was just like okay why not like i don't think you can actually go wrong with the cleansing balm i've been looking for i don't i've not been looking for but like i'm almost out of my all over the face all over the face jesus Okay, it's the same thing. The package the packaging is just different. Anyways, I've you know been wanting to change my all over the face powder, like my mineralizer. You know the powder you use, like obviously after like you put your foundation, all of that, and then you just want to set your whole face. Yeah. Wanted to change my powder. Yeah, I got this um La Mercier Smooth Finish Foundation Powder in. 5N115. Next thing that I got is this uh, beauty blender holder. Because why not? And then I got a few booty blenders. I got a few. Ah! Not my battery. Oh. Not my battery dying. Jesus. I got these beauty blenders. I got the Charlotte Tilbury airbrush for the setting spray. I've heard so much about this setting spray and I really wanted to try it. 
then obviously I got my eyebrow pencils. Um, and I got these um facial razor facial razor set. I already used one. I already used one out of it, so that's why one is missing. And I got hey God, yeah, I squeezed the hell out of all the, compressed the hell out of all this packaging. Then I got this glow recipe watermelon watermelon glow niacinamide dew drops. Just cause like I've heard that Glow Recipe is a really good brand and I really I've been looking to incorporate like serums into my routine, my skincare routine. The only thing I have is like um, I cleanse my face, I pull my toner, I pull my essence and then I moisturize but I'm really looking for like a good serum and I'm still yet to try it but like I'll let you guys know how that goes. And then I also got this Glow Recipe Plump plump hyaluronic serum a serum i just got another serum hyaluronic acid is a holy grail for me my skin really loves moisture and like hydration so like yeah that's why i got this next thing this one i got from water beauty i got this um advanced nail 96 mucin powder essence from cos all right i don't know how to pronounce this brand but like i see so many people using this pea I still don't really using this thing. They're like everybody's like, oh, this is so good. And like obviously this has like this acts to like hydration and like that moist, making your skin plump and nice and glowy and dewy. So like yeah, I had to try it. Um I got this one from Ulta. And then I also got um a setting spray, this Morphe setting spray I've used before and yeah they have like the white and the black one i prefer the black one because that one gives a more dewy finish meanwhile like the white one gives a more mattifying finish so you know that's why i got this one to try no that's why i got this one again not to try then again from glow recipe i got my water i got a watermelon a watermelon glow ultra fine mist this mist i've heard so much about it and you know i've seen like the likes of jackie dodos all of that all of them i've seen the likes of them using this and you know i just had to try like it's a mist for like if you're not wearing makeup and even when you wear makeup to set your makeup you can use it so i feel like this would give more of like a dewy finish as well which is really nice so like i really wanted to like you know try it i got like two of that and then I got my Milk Hydro Grip Primer, which like, you know, I ran out of how many years back, I don't even know. But like, yeah, I got like two of it because again, this gives more of like a dewy finish for, like when you do your makeup. And I found that I actually like dewy finishes. I don't like matte when your face is just matte. I don't like it. I mean, like it can, it can be a good look, but like, I feel like I f prefer more of a dewy look. So yeah, I just got two of that. I know you guys are actually about to die. That's it for my Sephora haul. It was a bit rushed, but like maybe I'll try and link everything that I got down below in the description box. Or like I'll just write them out in the screen as I talk, even though it's been like very fast. Anyways, I'm back. I'm going to the mall with my mom and my sisters. Also, you guys, updates. Recently, I've been reading a lot. And like, I've grabbed like a couple of books that I've heard like good things about, both like on Instagram and on like TikTok. A lot of the books I've grabbed are by Colin Hoover. I, her books are actually really, really good. To be fair, I've only read one, but like I've heard that her books are actually really, really good. So I've grabbed like a couple of them. Um, I finished reading. So over the past week, these are the books that I bought. I'm done with, I got this, I think, yeah, I got this in the UK, Ugly Love, and I'm done with this. I liked it, like, it was kind of like a slow burner, and it dragged a bit, but, like, I'm not completely, like, against it. It's just that, actually, let's just say that on a scale of 1 to 10, I'd probably rate this, like, a 6. Then, I'm currently on this one, it ends with us. I've heard so much about this, and so far, it's actually really, really good. I can't wait to finish it, or oh, only other ones I have, and I kind of, like, arranged them in order of how I want to read them. I heard so much about it in five years. I heard, like, really, really good things about it. I'm going to be reading Variety by Colin Hoover. <laughs> when I tell you that, I almost went crazy grabbing all her books. Like, I actually did almost go crazy, but... I had to be careful. I just had to make sure that obviously they had like good, 
reviews or whatever which is why like i picked out these ones for now but i'm definitely going to buy some more also book talk recommended um maybe someday which is also by colin hoover apparently this one's really good as well so yeah i'm ready to go put my home starts to yell bye i just want to show you guys what i got today the first thing i'm going to show you guys <laughs> phone charm that's what i'm going to call it but it's this phone accessory that i've been seeing and like no my battery dying what kind of rubbish is this this phone accessory i've been seeing like a lot of people use i've always wanted one so i walked into urban office yesterday and i saw it and i got myself one from origin so i just repurchased the mask that i use like if you've been watching me for a while or you've seen my only like beauty haul on this um, channel you know that this is the mask that i have been using for a while let me know this is like a charcoal de detoxifying mask so like obviously it's going to strip your skin of all its oil but like when i'm done with that i know how to like rehydrate with my other products but like let me know if you want to know what uh, mask that i use for hydration this so i just today i just repurchased this um i got some body mists from victoria's secret bare vanilla surf on the waves that's amber romance velvet petals midnight bloom so i feel like my fave scent out of like all five is probably bare vanilla i like keep repurchasing bare vanilla every other thing every other scent can change for me but i keep repurchasing bare vanilla because i just love vanilla scents like i got this home powered imagine me not imagine me not since we're doing manual label i want to tell siri to do the work for me how about that that's why i got this they had like like i think like four or five different colors they had blue they had white they had black they had this color which is kind of like an orange burnt orange kind of color and then they had yellow which was what Audi got and yeah I chose this color I just feel like it will fit very well with my room you all know that I am a Zara whore <sighs> so I don't care if it's one item I pick each time I visit a Zara store I will shop pick something like I have to get something from there so like I'm just going to like try and I picked out like three items I'm going to try out I'm going to try on um, the items I picked out and I will show you guys. Okay, so this is the first top. Got this in black as well. I'm going to be trying on the black one. I just want to show you guys the fits because you get the gist. You get the gist. Ooh, guys, I love this one. I got this. It's, it looks very similar to the one i just tried on i'll show you the black one i didn't show you guys the black one um this is the black one of the pink one i just wore this one looks very 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 similar to the um one i just tried on but they are very they are different so like the cut here is very different the detail on the hand I love it and then I it's more cropped it's more cropped than the one I just tried on and yeah like there's this also this like detail on this top that isn't on the other one my makeup bag I don't know if I ever showed you guys probably not because it is very appalling my makeup bag there not now because I changed it I got some like cute bags from from tj maxx i already spoke i didn't spoil it i don't understand why the zip just popped off like that like i don't understand why, why, why are you acting weak? um i got a set um, i don't know if i can show you without everything falling off because i told you guys that the zip of one of the sides popped off but like this on this side i have like confection products um what's this who the hell? Yeah, you have to buy exactly. I don't know who this man is. Anyways, and here I just have like my primer, scent powder, um, highlighter, yeah, mascara. Like, but like I actually really, really love. I'm going to fix the zip that popped off. Like this is the other 
two really cute these downy bits in this one i just put like my eyeshadow palette that's all i put in this one I, by the way i didn't show you guys that i got this, this murphy makeup brush set from ulta beauty put it in here because i intend for like my makeup brushes and beauty banners to go in here when they are clean so that's why they're not in here yet because i haven't washed them <coughs> and then i got one more makeup bag i'm gonna show you guys i think i'm going to put like random makeup inside there i'll just use that for my makeup brushes and beauty blender since like it's bigger than this i might just use this for something else so it's bigger it's way bigger than this one so i might just use this for my makeup brushes and beauty blenders instead of this one because it's bigger so yeah you guys every single thing i got from tj maxx and i'm very very happy with this bag my makeup bag before this was very appalling and very embarrassing so i'm very happy that i got these at least you know i can put my makeup in something when i'm traveling we've been here for like almost two weeks we haven't used our pool since we've been here so we decided to swim tonight so the time currently 8 49 p.m and I have my swimsuit on I don't have a hair dryer to actually dry my hair but the good thing is that I didn't put my hair inside the water that much so I tried to hold it up I got it in the water just a little bit but not too much thankfully because there's no hair dryer so if I put the whole thing inside the water I wonder what my life will be looking like right now thank god I used my brain okay hi guys um, I already filmed like an unboxing video for TikTok, uh, but I also want to show you guys here on YouTube. Is I got the AirPods Max. I love the fact that it comes with a case and i just love this color so much i feel like there's no other color that i would have gotten honestly i'm very happy with this and part of the reason why i decided to actually get myself on is because my brother has one and i'm always begging him for his own i'm always stealing his own so like it only just made sense for me to get my own i know that i'll get a lot of use out of it it looks so beautiful so happy that i got this color <laughs> So the next thing that I got is from Tom Ford. I got a perfume. So I'm trying to build my perfume collection and I was kind of researching on which one to get 
on what brand to get perfume from this is the Iben Fume I hope I'm pronouncing it well but like yeah the salesperson was just like this is for saying that this is one of their newest scents and it actually smells really 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 good well, I already have one perfume from Tom Ford which I was just like okay let me try some more scents from Tom Ford because I really like the one that I have but yeah you guys I'm going to end this vlog here because I feel like this is getting too long now but like I hope you guys have enjoyed watching so far and if you have don't forget to like comment share subscribe all that good stuff i haven't said this in a while but if there's any parts of the vlog that you particularly enjoyed the most or like you know you just want to see something and you want to comment on whatever this just that's what the comments are for that's what the comment section is for and also watch it with people share it with other people if you really enjoyed it if you like my channel please share it with some other people so that i can go <laughs>